Welcome to our channel. My name is Yvette and this is Tyler. Come along with us as we sail the high seas or hit the open road while we navigate and explore this beautiful planet our way. Welcome on board Tootsie Marie and back to my boat garden series where I play around with growing a garden on my boat. In my last boat garden episode, I was talking about wanting to find some type of tomato cage or some way to help support the plants as they get taller and bigger. Luckily, I found these little stakes, which are perfect for the boat. Because there's a lot of movement out on the water, especially when we're underway, a traditional tomato cage would be too top heavy. So this is the perfect compromise. I'm calling it quits on the geraniums. This is my third time trying to grow them from seed and they just don't seem to be thriving here. After inspecting this plant, there's one little tomato starting up here at the top. And then there's two suckers shooting off here that will be flowering. And this one is flowering. So my plan is to cut the top part off to allow these two, which are bearing a lot more fruit than this lonely one up here, the chance to grow. I just want to make sure I'm cutting the right thing. Okay, time to compost. So tomorrow, I'll add some new topsoil. Okay, so these are the two tomato plants. This one is just starting to bloom. I just cut this long shoot off the top because it only had one tomato fruiting and I just figured I'd sacrifice the big thing to hopefully get more blooms on this. And then look at this. Look how big that tomato is. And this one's starting to blush, like what a joke. <laughs> These tomatoes are supposed to be the size of my fist. So, I guess I'm grateful there's blooms, but this one I have higher hopes for. So, just wanted to show you. I'm about to have a robust harvest here on Tootsie Marie. that time of day when all the boats in the mooring field or anchorage are going a different direction. Having some mixed emotions today because the smallest little tomato is ready to harvest, but it is <laughs> so small. So I'm going to take it off the plant and cut into it. I'm so curious if the seeds will be big or small. So let's find out. <laughs> it's so pathetic. Look at this. It's not even the size of a cherry tomato. It smells like a tomato. <laughs> if 
feel like this should be in like French food or something. There's no, there isn't any seeds in there. The moment of truth will give her a try. <laughs> it tastes so good. I just wish it was a little bit bigger. <laughs> but it's a win. We grew a tomato on board Tootsie Marine. Hopefully this will be the first of many. I have high hopes for the second plant.